Today, I'll be taking you through economics activities. Now, recall that economics is a branch of knowledge which deals with production, uh, consumption, and creation of wealth. From the word economics and its definition, we certainly know that the activities is around production, is around satisfying human wants. So the economic activities are basically production, distribution, and consumption. These are the main activities in economics. Production is the art of transforming raw materials into finished goods. You can process cassava into finished goods to get uh, gari, to get santana, so and other stuff you can get from cassava. In that case, you've processed this raw material and you've gotten a finished goose. So this is one activity in economics, production. After production, you don't just keep the goose. You have to distribute it because production is not com complete until the goose produced gets to the final consumers. If the consumers don't get the goods, then production is not complete. So distribution has to do with the various ways, the various channels in which you get your goods across to those concerned. So those are the people you are producing for whom to produce. So under distribution, you have to talk about uh, transportation, uh, storage, and other factors that will enhance your distribution. Now, after distribution, then consumption. You've distributed the goods, so the people you've made it for, they need to consume it. So the economic activities are, are production, distribution, and consumption. And they are grouped into three. So these activities you are seeing, they are grouped into three, or classified into three, which are primary, secondary, and tertiary activities. Now, primary activities deal with extraction of raw materials from land, sea, and various forms. For example, uh, farming, uh, mining, fishing, hunting, lumbering. If you look at these activities, they deal with extraction of raw materials. So any activity that has to do with extraction of raw materials, getting materials in its raw state, is a uh, primary activities. And secondary activities deal with uh, manufacturing and uh, co uh, construction. That's what secondary activity is concerned with. So in this case, you are converting the raw materials extracted into finished goods. And construction is also under secondary activities in economics. For example, building of houses. The raw materials you have or the goods produced, the, manuf the goods manufactured, you are now assembling them together, bringing them together to form a product. So that's what construction is about. You construct roads, houses, you construct bridges. The tertiary activities. Tertiary economic activities is divided into commercial production and services. <coughs> services are rendered. In economics, we have goods and we have services. Services are really not tangible. They are rendered. Like as I'm teaching now, I'm rendering a service. Yes, taxi driver, uh, taxi uh, boats or whatever. So that, that, those are services, or you hire a cleaner to help you clean the house. Those are services. So services is under tertiary activities and commercial uh, production. Service, a service can be direct or indirect. Direct services are the one you pay for directly. For example, when you enter a taxi or when you go to bab, all those things, all those services run out to you. Someone helps you to do something and you are paying the person. So that's direct service. Indirect service has to do with the services you enjoy, but you are not paying for them directly. For example, in the university, you pay school fees, fine. However, you, you don't pay the teachers directly, you don't pay your lecturers directly. You don't pay policemen, you don't pay them directly. You don't pay soldiers directly. So all those services that you don't pay for directly, but you enjoy, they are indirect services. So another branch of tertiary activities in economics is commercial production. <coughs> commercial pro commerce deals with uh, buying and selling business generally. So commercial production deals with banking, 
financial institutions where you uh, keep or you take loan, where money is being circulated, uh, where housing is storing your goods. You need to store your goods to avoid a uh, wastage. Transportation, moving of goods say, uh, to, uh, from one location to another. Uh, tourism, advertising, promoting your goods and services, insurance. So these are under commercial production and they are tertiary activities. So in summary, economic activities are production, distribution, and consumption. And they are classified or grouped into three. Primary activities, secondary activities, and tertiary activities. Primary activities is with extraction of raw materials from land, sea, and so on. Or uh, secondary activities deal with production and construction. Tertiary activities deal with commercial activities and rendering of services. So that's what you need to know under economics activities. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to this channel and don't forget to check out my many other videos.